You're now within the 360 tour of the High Voltage Lab at University of Manchester. We are UK's largest multi-purpose high voltage lab. Within this lab, we can test equipment that goes onto the electrical network. We also use this lab to teach engineers about high voltages and associated equipment. In front of you is our impulse generator. You could also call it the lightning maker. With this piece of equipment, we can generate up to 2 million volts. This video will guide you through a few demos using this piece of equipment. What you see is lightning breaking down air. The gap between the two electrodes in front of you is just over two meters, and it takes over a million volts to bridge this gap. What happens if you have an aircraft between these two electrodes? Let's rerun this test. What you see in front of you is a lightning strike hitting a model aircraft. The model aircraft is wrapped in aluminum foil which allows the lightning current to travel safely over the surface of the aircraft without damaging any of the electronic components inside. Let's look at this one more time. What you've just seen is an aircraft being hit by lightning. Whilst this is actually very important, most of the time our lab is used to actually test electrical equipment that goes on our network. Right now, behind me, is an overhead line insulator that's usually strung on pylons that you see on the highway. We're going to see if this can take 1.1 million volts. Lightning can hit overhead lines and pylons, and when this happens, the insulators need to withstand the lightning flash and sustain no damage. In the next demo, we will energize our Tesla coil. The Tesla coil was invented by the pioneer Nikola Tesla. Nikola Tesla was instrumental in how we use and understand electricity. The voltage at the top of the Tesla coil can reach several million volts. This is where we see streamers. Whilst the Tesla coil is not used for any scientific experiments within this lab, it sure gives an insight into high voltages and how streamers behave. Hope you've enjoyed this video. More information about electrical and electronics engineering and our high voltage labs can be found in the links below. Thank you.